Ignition. We have liftoff. CCCX Inflection shareholders, how are we doing? I'm busting, Jerry. I'm busting. There's so much positive news coming out, and I love to see it. We got a lot to talk about here. Churchill Capital and Inflection are taking the step forward, a next step forward, into becoming officially Inflection with the ticker symbol INFQ. We'll show you that paperwork here in a second. My guess is January. I'm hoping that for January that we officially become Inflection and the ticker changes. Inflection is getting awards, high praise. We have an in-house scientist who's won an award. We'll show you that here. Citron Research, they're going ham on inflection. They're going hard as a mofo. They're involved. They're comparing it against Rigetti. They're shorting Rigetti. They're saying inflection is the one you need to be in. We're going to show you that here in a second. I'm obsessed with this company. I don't know how it became, but I am. I love the vision. I love the potential. I love the management team. This is the first quantum stock that I've ever owned. I just have full faith and trust in this one over the others. The more research I do, the more I like. Now they keep telling me. After the specs, you're gonna drop 50%, you're gonna drop 90%. Make my day. I'm ready for it. I will, I will accumulate so much shares. I dare you to drop. I dare you. I wanna see it. I wanna see it. This is a long-term hold. I'm not holding this for a week or two. I'm not holding this for months. This is years. I want inflection to be king of quantum. You may say no kings. I say, I want to be king. Love this company, love it. Now. I have a very, I'm very passionate about this company. You may be passionate about another company. Let me know what that is. If you have full faith, if you've done the research on, on a company, you can see the vision, you can see the potential, you can see the execution, you trust the management team. If there's a stock out there that you have complete faith in, we know that stocks are gonna go up and down, but if there's one out there that you just, you just say, this is the one, <laughs> this is the one, let me know in the comments because I'm always looking for new opportunities. I'm always looking to do more research on other companies. Maybe I can put out a video on it. Um, but let me know what's on your radar. If there's something that you're really, truly passionate about, let me know what that is. I'm going to take a look. Now, Steve Grasso, he's a trader. You see him on CNBC. He's in and out of uh, inflection stock. Uh, he, he, he posts all the time, and he was in. He was out back in October. Now he looks like he's back in. But I'm in it. I ain't going anywhere. Well, 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 would you look at that. Our chief scientist, Mark Safman, awarded 2026 APS Ramsey Prize. Mark Safman, director of the Wisconsin Quantum Institute, won the American Physical Society's 2026 Norman F. Ramsey Prize in Atomic Molecular and Optical Physics and in Precision Tests of Fundamental Laws and Symmetries. The Ramsey Prize recognizes outstanding accomplishments in the two fields of Norman Ramsey, Atomic, Molecular, and Optical Physics and Precision Tests of Fundamental Laws and Symmetries, Safman won for semifinal developments of quantum information processing with neutral atoms that allow the investigation of many body problems that are, that are intractable by classical computing. He said, it became clear to me that to compete at the forefront, I needed more resources. I wanted to go faster, Safman says. So I ended up joining forces with cold quanta, which is now inflection, an existing small cold atom sensing in components company. Safman brought his quantum computing ideas to the company as chief scientist for quantum information at Colorado-based Inflection in 2018, and the company now has a satellite office in Madison. Inflection demonstrated the first quantum algorithm to be run on an atomic quantum computer. It was a huge proof of principle and significant step forward in the field. And on Inflection's website, top header, congratulations to Inflection's Mark Safman, 2026 Ramsey Prize winner for his pioneering work in quantum information processing with neutral atoms. Learn more? Yes, please. And then it takes us to the Department of Physics at the University of Wisconsin-Madison. And Mark is getting a lot of love on LinkedIn. Congratulations all over the place. Woot woot, congrats. Also looking forward to your talk this weekend. Thank you for being a wonderful educator in our field, helping to inspire future scientists with a travel and work schedule on par with the best of them. Love it. And there's just the congratulations. It just keeps going. It keeps going. Oh, man. We got killers on this team. We got absolute killers on this team. Love to see it. All right, another step forward. Inflection in Churchill Capital Corp. X announced confidential submission of draft registration statement on Form S-4 in connection with proposed business combination. Oh, yeah, hot off the presses. The submission of the registration statement marks an important milestone toward the completion of the previously disclosed proposed business combination between the two parties. 
The company's product portfolio includes quantum computers, clocks, RF receivers, inertial sensors, all engineered for real-world deployment and optimized with Inflections software. These systems are already in use in collaboration with NVIDIA and by the U.S. Department of Defense, NASA, the U.K. government. And upon closing this deal, Inflection will become the first publicly listed neutral atom quantum technology company and the only public company with commercial leadership across both quantum computing and precision sensing. And we're well capitalized. We're ready. We're ready to expand. Some of the achievements, 12 logical qubits with error detection and loss correction. Our roadmap is to deliver 1,000 logical qubits by 2030. We're going to continue to expand collaboration with NVIDIA. NVQ link quantum architecture to GPU accelerated AI systems. We demonstrated the world's first quantum optical clock for underwater autonomous navigation with the Royal Navy. We have a strategic partnership with Silicon Light Machines to enhance quantum computer performance through next generation optical technologies. And of course, upon closing, we will be INFQ. First quarter of 2026. I hope it's in January. I can't wait. Citron Research. They're long CCCX. They're short Rigetti. They say the S-4 filed on October 29th. The clock just started. In 60 to 90 days, CCCX will become inflection, INFQ. And SPAC restrictions vanish. Quantum ETFs, defense funds, pension funds, currently blocked, can suddenly buy, expanding the buyer base by three to four times overnight. $540 million cash hits the balance sheet. This converges with Rigetti Q3 earnings November 10th. Expect more decline, they say, in Rigetti's earnings. And they're looming dilute of capital raise. Both catalysts hit the same window. Institutional wave up for CCCX. Disaster down for Rigetti. They're going hard. They're going ham on inflection. And they are trashing Rigetti spaghetti. The math at $5 billion each. CCCX doubles plus 100%. Rigetti cuts in half. 57%. Pair returns, 157%. This assumes equal valuations despite inflection having 3.6x more revenue, 80% more growth versus 37% decline, and the Royal Navy submission deployment versus zero defense presence. At $5 billion, Rigetti still trades at 633 times declining revenue. So much more. Dang, Citron going hard. And Citron continues to compare us against Rigetti. The most compelling trade in quantum. And we take a look at the market caps of Rigetti and inflection and where the share prices are and where they sh where inflection should be compared to Rigetti based on our revenue, based on our market cap. We should be trading to a premium to Rigetti. We'll see how it plays out in the near future. And let's not forget the U.S. Department of Energy has announced $625 million investment to advance the next phase of the National Quantum Information Science Research Centers, driving innovation and strengthening America's quantum ecosystem. Trump doesn't want to lose to China. We're behind. We need to catch up. Inflection is going to be a part of that. And Inflection is proud to partner with Quantum Science Center to integrate our neutral atom quantum computers into high-performance computing systems. We're also supporting superconducting quantum materials and systems centers with SuperStack, our quantum compilation tool set that optimizes performance across platforms. Let's not forget, China is leading the race in investments in quantum technology. The U.S. government needs to catch up. They're not, they're not going to let China beat us here. So there's going to be investments in quantum. And it continues to put a spotlight on the quantum space and who's well positioned and who's trusted by governments more than the others. Inflection. So we're going to be in good hands here going forward. There's going to be a lot of investment in quantum from the United States. And we're just getting started. And inflection continues to hit the road. Upcoming events and webinars will be at the UK National Quantum Technology Showcase November 8th in London, England. We'll be at Supercomputing, SC25, November 16th through the 21st, St. Louis, Missouri. QTB, Silicon Valley, December 9th through 11th, Santa Clara, California. And in December 9th through 11th, National Harbor, Maryland, Association of Old Crows International Symposium and Convention. Keep hitting the road, boys. I'm still in the red. My cost basis is around $22. That's okay. I'm holding long-term, finding opportunities to buy. If this thing de and drops... 50%, I'm buying a lot more. So I'm excited about where we're going. Let me know if you're still buying CCCX Inflection. Let me know if you were just trading it. Let me know if you've gotten out completely, waiting for it to de-spac. I think we're just going to hold this one for a while, a long while. I hope you're doing well. Take care. Bye.